Welcome to another episode of Insured in a Minute. I'm Troy Burns. Do you remember that time when you've been with a girl for a while and you feel like the moment is right? You've been thinking about this over and over and over in your head for months. You're just trying to plan it. And all of a sudden, she gives you that look. Your palms start to sweat and your stomach gets in knots. And you just, oh yeah. And then you go to the moment and you get there and you drop to your knees and you propose. <laughs> uh, where did you think I was going with it? What you might not have thought about is if you would have shown up and that ring had fallen through the hole in your pocket and now you're there left with nothing but your your hand. She doesn't want your hand. She wants a ring. So what happens now? Well, hopefully you have purchased a tenant or a condo package which ensures your contents so that your jewelry would be covered if you had a comprehensive policy and would be covered for such things such as mysterious disappearance. Now, there might be a limit on to what coverage you have if, say, you lost the ring due to theft. Then you'd want your ring appraised and insured separately on your policy and have a separate deductible for that in this case. If you would like more information on how to properly insure your jewelry, please contact your broker. From Blocks Agencies News, I'm Troy Burns. Speaking of first times, <laughs>